News reporter Liz Kreutz is in LA with new details. As a winter storm marches east, heavy snow, rain, and wind causing chaos coast to coast. In the west, snow clobbering the mountains of Northern California. These whiteout conditions leading to power outages and road closures. I-80 into the Sierra Nevada restricted to only vehicles with chains. There's a bunch of semis stuck up on the highway and we can't get anywhere. The wintry conditions forcing some ski resorts to close. We just wanted to hit the slopes. <laughs> this from Heavenly Mountain in South Lake Tahoe. Chairs on the ski lift violently swaying from wind gusts topping 65 miles per hour. Rain also pummeling the state. Parts of the Bay Area down to L.A. seeing three to four inches of rain from a so-called atmospheric bowling ball, causing flooding, spin outs and rock slides. Moving east in Utah this morning, a bus driver losing control on the slick roads. The bus rolling over, 18 of the 25 people on board taken to the hospital. Parts of the Northeast also seeing their first big snow of the year. In Boston, the powerful storm causing hours-long delays at Logan International Airport. Exhausted travelers seen sleeping on cots. It's going to be a long night. Blizzard conditions now heading into the heartland. Severe storms also expected in the south, including the threat for tornadoes. And here in the West, people are starting to dig out after getting in some places five feet of snow. Forecasters say as this widespread storm moves east this week, it will impact nearly every state in the country. Liz Kreutz, ABC News, Los Angeles.